the best performance winner, Christopher Judge for God of War Ragnarok. I see why I couldn't get more than a plus one. Um, thank you to the Game Awards. Um, first of all, uh, I have to thank my mama. Um, whose belief that I would amount to something good would uh, never waver even though it looked like I'd never amount to anything good. Um, my brother, who's my hero, at 40, changed his life, went to medical school, and is now Dr. Judge. <laughs> my children. who I am forever proud of, forever thankful of, and still the best role I've ever had is being your dad. <laughs> Sony Santa Monica. <laughs> Miss Yumi Yang. It is an honor and a pleasure to work for you and with you. You are a unicorn because you actually proved that for the first time ever, the trickle-down theory actually worked. <laughs> Corey Barlog, thank you, brother. Thank you uh, for believing in me, and uh, thank you for having me read for the role. Um, I was the last actor in California to read for it. Um, <laughs> and Corey said to me he didn't think I would do it. And uh, if I had known it was a video game back then, I might not have. Boy, how things have changed. Um, Matt, Rich, Dory, Bruno, Erica, B, all, everyone who made that volume so special and so sacred, uh, everyone at every level, be it designer, be it whatever it was, who worked under extraordinary conditions to get this game out. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Eric Williams. I, I think it's kind of common knowledge that uh, we were honored to go to Tribeca after 2018. And when Corey took me outside and said he wouldn't be directing the next one, I literally did quit. I quit. And he said, no, nah, I vouch for Eric. And I said, Eric Williams better be a beast. Eric Williams is a motherfucking beast. <laughs> I relate 
to Corey on kind of an artistic level, a level of, of that side of me. <sighs> Eric Williams and I are from such the same place, two different parts of the country, two different upbringings, but two from a very similar emotional place. And I'll never forget, I guess I can't say what it was, but it was something that moved me so deeply. And there's a, there's a time frame that cinematics have to fit into. Hopefully not speeches. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and I, I, I couldn't reel it in. And Eric came over to me. <laughs> and he, he just hugged me and just held me as I was sobbing. <laughs> and then he said words I will never forget. Okay, big guy, now give us one we can use. to this amazing, wonderful group of actors. Um, who brought as much or more than I did every single day. I, I mean, we were in there and the bravery of this group of actors to share their heartache, their loves, their lost loves, their loneliness. I am so grateful and thankful that I got to spend all those days in that volume with you. This is for all of us. Sonny. I wasn't lying, I voted for you. Your work was astounding. You're the future of this. Just never forget the two things I hopefully gave you. Hire me, don't be a douchebag. <laughs> to every single person in this room, no matter what game it was you touched, you are heroes because you got so many people in the world through a very difficult, dark time that's still not over. <laughs> Games and the gaming community mean so much to this world, it's so much in the course of dreams and escapism and, and just being better. Um, thank you, thank you to the rest of the nominees. Have a great night. And I met Al Pacino. <laughs>